Okay. So now we're going to go ahead and cover how to add artifacts to your digital portfolio. So I'm going to go show how you would see it. So of these tabs here, if you're still adding pages, switch over to Insert. And we're going to do From Drive. And I'm going to go to the folder where I've uploaded my artifacts, or maybe I created them in the folder already from Google Docs, whatever it might be. Okay, so these are the things I'm going to go ahead and add to my portfolio. And you can see I've got all of my pathways assignments, and right now I'm on my digital photography tab. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to select the photo I'd like to put in. I'm going to scale it, and then I'm going to write a reflection. And the reflection is going to basically describe what we are looking at in terms of an artifact and what I learned from it. And that should include basically, uh, I'm sorry, artifacts can come in the form of images, photographs of work that you've done physically, um, Google Docs, you know, papers, YouTube videos, slideshow, presentations. So artifact is basically anything that you've completed in the class that you, you know, can show what you've done some learning with. So you'd go ahead and we would do, uh, still under insert, we do text box and I would start to write my reflection. Um, you're gonna want, you know, probably like a five sentence paragraph. And for the purposes of this, I'm going to just go ahead and pause this right now because I don't need you to watch me type and I don't wanna waste your time on that. Okay, so as you can see, I've written a fairly comprehensive reflection and kind of talked about the processes I used in Adobe Photoshop and, you know, without getting into two details of the specific class, Basically, it talked about a lot of the things that I learned and used and, and how I basically made this image. So then um, I've got some more artifacts. I'm going to go to another class. I'm going to go to English class. And I'm going to, again, insert from Drive. It's kept me in the same folder, which is nice. Uh, my English artifact. So here's a paper that I wrote for English class. And... Where'd it go? Let's try that one more time. English artifact selected and click. Okay, well. Okay, just took a minute there. Again, uh, I experience your struggles just the same as you do when we have fun with the technology. Okay, so you can see it's not quite displaying yet, but it's loading. And you can see I'm grabbing this blue circle and I'm dragging the box lower, you want to make sure that your artifacts are, here we go, you want to make sure that the artifacts are really kind of fill up the page, you don't want them kind of just all squished off into the corner like that, no one can read that. So let's go ahead and um, expand this. And then with this as well, you would also go ahead, go down to the bottom, insert a text box and write your reflection. And I guess I could even have a title to my reflection if you wanted and go ahead and write that reflection there.